on YouTube is throwing an only Vortex back at it with another banger and in today's video I'll be showing you guys the best point guard demigod guard build in NBA 2K23 area y'all so um, I'm doing this on current gen but it should be the same thing on next gen so uh, it shouldn't really be much of a difference but you know a lot of people have been requesting a build video or even you know a guard build video so um, I was like you know why not come on give it to you guys alright and this guard build I highly recommend using Right, because you can literally do everything with this build you can literally play lockdown defense crazy shooting and stuff like that but um i don't want to do a lot of talking you know i don't want to waste a lot of time talking and stuff like that you know what i mean but if you're new to the channel make sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new i'll put daily gaming videos and um like the video i really appreciate it please like the video and um yeah without further ado let's get into today's video so right here for the height obviously we will go six one okay so um highly recommend that if you are a guard just always go six one and then for the uh you know weight we're gonna go 196 now this is really good so far and you guys will see the stats later but for the weight spam it's obviously six seven are y'all and of course for the body shape really you can choose whatever you want um uh, i'm just go with bill usually i go with bill you know because i want my boy to look shreddy you feel me i want my boy to look like he on some gym time prime time you know what i mean but um, right here we're going to get into the stats, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed this part up so you guys can see what I have and stuff like that. But um, if you guys want to change something right here, go ahead and change it. But I highly recommend that you just do what I'm doing. And uh, yeah, let me just speed it up real quick. All right, so right here, these will be the stats. All right, y'all, I'm just going to go ahead and put them all up and everything. And I'm telling you guys, this is a really good build, especially that we get a lot of shooting badges and defensive badges, all right? And then we're, of course, going to have some um, playmaking and finishing which is really good so these badges will really really come in hand but as i said you want to be that point guard that how do i say it? you want to play your role you want to do your job you know you want to get some shots out score on makeup stuff like that you know you want to be that point guard that everybody can be like oh give it to him that's an obviously green and if you get stuck you can just go ahead do some playmaking dribble moves and stuff like that and dunk on a man you feel me but um yeah so just right here we're gonna start with the finishing i even zoomed in for y'all so for the finishing we're going to start off with the close shot for the close shot just keep it at 50 for right now 75 driving layup all right so i see the driving dunk and stuff like that it's not really up there but as i said we're really going to focus on that shooting right now we're going to put you know more time and effort into the shooting all right but right here the good thing is mid-range we have an 80 mid-range all right and then for the three-point shot we got a 92 and a free throw 67 and then we want to go down to the plane making now, of course, I'm going to go ahead and change some of these right now, but these aren't like the official, but I'm going to show you guys even when I do change them. So, playmaking, we have it at 84 right now. Uh, ball we handle 94, which is pretty insane, all right, y'all? Really, really good. And then you got speed with ball 82. Like, you about to be dribbling and running past people like the Flash. With Sonic, you don't even know, man. But, um, yeah, so defensive right here, really, the best, best thing that I really like is that you're steel. You can look at that steel, man, all right? So that's what you really want to upgrade steel and perimeter defense that's pretty insane as i said so um and then after that you want to go down to the physical of course you want to put the stamina up to like a 99 and all that type of stuff because this year physical like really really matter all right let me put it that way it really does have a huge role it does matter like crazy all right y'all and if you guys look at it as of right now we have seven potential finishing badges 25 shooting badges and um, we will end up with like 24 to 25 um, playmaking badges as well. All right, y'all. But um, yeah, so I know that for sure because like a build that has like 25, 25, 25, or even like 25, 24 badges, like it's pretty crazy, man. Because having these builds these days, like people make them to where it has like 16, 20 badges that you can actually max out. But you guys have 25 badges for each right now, except for the finishing, of course but once you have that plus four badges it's gonna go crazy y'all so of course we can get the plus four badges for each one and stuff like that and uh it's gonna be it's gonna be crazy all right y'all but right here as i said we're just gonna run over it again this is like the official you want to say kind of so um yeah 80 mid-range shot three point is a 92 man if you have over an 80 mid-range or 80 you know shooting that's already good enough all right so these are the official stats right here so make sure you guys go ahead and copy these right here these are the official ones but as i said 
three point is a 92 and then once you hit like a 99 and stuff like that it's gonna go up as well too it's it's pretty insane all right y'all but these are the official um stats right here for finishing shooting defensive slash rebounding and of course physicals all right y'all and as i said we ended up with 25 defense shooting and uh playmaking so right here for the playmaking this is really really good because you got shot creator sharpshooter playmaking takeover and lock down takeover like a defensive like bro that's pretty crazy these takeovers are insane and the good thing is this here you can change your takeover so literally you guys can change it whenever you want but right here for the primary takeover i went with the sharpshooting and lockdown as my secondary you know what i mean because i want to have that lockdown defense and you know take crazy shots you know and look at that we have stephen curry bro stephen curry to a shot creator i'm telling you guys this is one of the best six one builds that we got build in the game so guys go ahead try it out let me know what you all you know think about it but right here for the badges really um these are the badges i feel like are really really good i highly recommend you put these badges so for the finishing we're gonna have fearless finisher and then we're gonna have slithery and of course giant slayer on gold all right so go ahead put those I highly recommend them now for the shooting we have 25 shooting badges y'all we are going to go crazy this is actually pretty insane all right but um put agent three uh you know gold then we're gonna, of course we're gonna put green machine on hall of fame a uh, volume shooter on bronze and then we're gonna have um amp it on uh gold yeah we're gonna have it on gold and then of course we're gonna have dead eye on gold as well limit range on gold okay so um these are pretty little badges right here y'all telling you guys you guys can go ahead and change it up really to any badges that you want any badges that you feel comfortable with playing with but these badges i highly recommend you put them all right but as i said your choice on the badges really each player has his different play style so at the end of the day your badges is how you play and you know how your game style is but other than that let's just jump into the playmaking so as you guys can see for the playmaking i have um ankle bait uh, ankle breaker on bronze then we have clamp breaker on gold after clamp breaker on gold you go ahead and we have handles for days on gold and then we have um quick first step hall of fame I highly recommend you always have that on hall of fame then we have unpluckable gold you don't want to get ripped trust me with these lockdowns out here you do not want to get ripped and then killer combos on bronze all right y'all but um finally for the defensive badges this is why i like this build that's why I, I love this build man because we have 25 defensive badges so once we put them badges on it's locked down on defense and of course we got the shots and stuff like that so um yeah but as you guys can see right here i got clamps on silver i have uh chase down artists on silver of course no matter what you always want to have glove on hall of fame and then we got challenger on gold and then we have pick dodger silver interceptor gold okay i was really kind of deciding on if i should put interceptor on like you know maybe silver or something like that and you know switching around with work work, work horse sorry i can't even speak right now but if you guys want to change up some badges you guys can actually put it on workhorse because workhorse is also a really good badge especially you know stuff like that but um yeah as you guys can see we have challenger on hall on gold and then we have glove on hall of fame always any build always put your um max out glove and then clamps you know we have it on uh silver interceptor gold we just kept it at gold to be honest i kept it at gold and then chase down artist silver and uh pick dodger on silver now you want pick dodger especially if you run tools and stuff like that because you know centers once they see you are kind of small or whatever they're going to set you them screens and you want to be quick to move around them all right y'all but um as i said go ahead have have pick dodger on silver because i got a center build all right and i'm telling you guys when i play against people that don't got like you know uh pick pick dodger it's it's bad because i'll be putting them balls on the ground man let me tell you that but um yeah but you guys can go ahead and switch up the badges as i said it depends on how you play how's your game style and stuff like that but uh yeah that's pretty much it for today's video this is literally one of the best six one point guard demigod build in the game all right y'all and guys i'm a center all right so if there's any point guards out there that want to run let me know in the comment section down below a lot of streams and stuff like that where i play on my subscribers so if you want to run just let me know in the comment section down below all right leave your like um playstation plus name like psn name i mean uh you know gamer tag whatever it is leave in the comment section down below 
and just send me an invitation on um playstation i'm on playstation right now all right y'all so if you're on playstation let me know but as i said really that's pretty much it for today's video if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button like the video and turn on notifications but it's been the one and only vortex and i'll see you on the next one peace